Hello, Mom. We just got back. I know you've been waiting for the news. The tumor is malignant. No. No. Please don't come. You're not well. The flight's too long. Bree's a good friend. She'll be with me every minute. Stuart has to work, but he'll be with me as much as he can. Yeah. Yeah. Excuse me. Excuse me. Mind if I sit here? Excuse me. I'm sorry, what? Mind if I sit here? Oh no, go right ahead. Oh dear, I have an appointment to make anyway. Margaret Connors? Yes. Hello, I'm Brielle Keats. I'm sorry I'm late. Please come in. Thank you. I don't know what happened to the time. It just slipped away. I'm so sorry. Oh, that's all right. Oh, thank you. I'm a bit nervous. This is new to me. I've never been to a clairvoyance before. Can I take your coat? Oh, thank you. It's lovely in here. Thank you. My best friend, Marie Lynn, she had several sessions with you right before she died. Your friend was very special. You must miss her very much. Please sit down. You know, before Marie became ill, I remember the two of us talking that if one of us died suddenly from a car crash or something, that we try to communicate with each other from the dead. We had to laugh. Even Marie couldn't quite believe it, and she was the one who brought the subject up. Then the last time we saw each other, she truly believed it was possible to communicate with the dead. Are you the one who convinced her to believe such a thing? I told her I'd help her find her answers. I told her nothing more. Marie was very tired. You're angry that she made the decision to give up on her life. How did you know how I feel? I wish I could say that you were wrong, but it's, it's just that she was so young and she just seemed to give up. I don't understand. Let me explain. I don't use crystal balls or tarot cards. I don't read palms. I can't tell the future and I wouldn't even begin to try. What I do is help people get in touch with their spiritual and astral planes. You see, for me, ever since I was a child, they've been such a gift in my life. I want to find my own answers. I don't know why. I feel a little scared. There's nothing to be scared of. You'll see. The first thing we'll do is breathe together. We won't talk. We'll experience our senses without words. My energy will help you, and yours will help me. Soon you'll learn to trust your intuition. There are layers of energy fields in and around yourself that are just waiting to be discovered. Let your mind go where it happens to go. Don't try and control your thoughts. If it feels comfortable, place your palms in mine. Experience 
the stillness between each breath. Your breathing is a continuous cycle, like life and death. The ending of one breath is the beginning of another. Breathe slowly and deliberately. said you weren't at work. In fact, uh, he said you weren't at work a few days last week, so what have you been doing and where have you been going? Talk to me. I don't like talking about things anymore. I know she was your best friend, but we're still here. And I love you, sweetheart. You look like you could use something to eat. I'll go fix something. It's over. Dr. Sheldon said it couldn't have gone any better. Where's Bree? I'm here, sweetie. We're both here. You're going to be okay. You're going to be all right.
I know it's not my regular day. Thanks for seeing me. Oh, I'm glad I could. Come on in. Intimidation or coercion? Hmm. Mug, mugging, blackmail, burgle, hold up, heist. Let's see, how many letters? Six letters, second one, X. What do you think, Marie? What do you think, Marie? I don't know. Bree, this is hard. Bree, what? I don't want any more treatments. No more. I've made my decision. Stuart needs what time I have left. You can't come see me anymore. What on earth are you saying? Dr. Shelton says that there's another chemo treatment we can try. And don't be ridiculous. I can't leave you now. You never finish this crossword puzzle on your own. I've made my decision. Bree, listen to me. We'll see each other again. You have to trust that. We'll see each other again. You have to trust that. You have to trust that. To trust that. You have 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 to trust. You have to trust. You have to trust that. first time since she died, I feel peace. I've let go. There's a whole other realm within your touch. You seem so sure. You're so close. I wish I could feel this way all the time. The rational mind always wants to get in the way, but it won't. Trust yourself. Just think of all those abandoned people in a jail and I'm doing like a whole mural of junk and abandoned things. What a social statement. I probably could make maybe three thousand, four thousand dollars on this one. You know, and this is just the beginning. I was talking to Dante, he's a glass blower. We're thinking about making glass hubcaps that people can eat off of, the perfect plate, you know. You on a Chevrolet, you can have a Chevrolet hubcap plate. You can eat on it every night. What a great idea. Sweetheart, what year is this wine? I have to trust that. I don't know. You gotta like, get out of this. I mean, she's been gone for almost two months. It's two months now. I mean, why can't, why can't we just enjoy our dinner like normal people? Come on, let's eat and have a good time. All right. You're right.
Do you believe me now? Do you believe me now? Do you believe I told you we'd see each other again. I told you we'd see each other again. I miss you so much. I miss you so much. There's no reason to. There's no reason. We've been together. We've been You just haven't known it. You just haven't known it. You just haven't known it. I worry about you so much. Are you alright? We've nurtured each other for a long time, but it's time to change. 